Hi guys. I just thought I'd do a midnight vlog with Miss Bailey here. Um, sorry I've not been on for a while. Just been really, really busy. Um, can, uh, the council's coming to do uh, my new kitchen for me and things that I've had a lot of planning things to do, unexpected. And uh, she's doing fine. She's lovely, absolutely lovely. She, you know what she likes doing? Get off my finger. You know, she, she's really, I've never, I don't know if anyone else has had an hamster like it, but she wants to be with me all the time. I mean, all the time. And when I go to put her back in a cage, she kicks up her fuss. So what she does is she grabs hold of my finger as I'm putting her in. And she's sort of trying to drag me in the cage as I, as I say, come on, mummy, I want you to come in too with me. And I've never had that before. Never. And I'm thinking, what a weird hamster. See, like that, like that now. She gets hold of me, she locks onto my finger and then she just sort of drags it into the cage. <laughs> and I have to say, look, I can't come in there with you, darling. <laughs> You're going to say hello to people. You're going to say hello. Right, so she's fine. Louise is uh, starting to show signs of age, but she's totally fine. And another thing about her, she, she'll only eat in front of me. So what I have to do is I have to split her food in half. Half, half when she's out with me, so she'll eat. And the other half is in the bowl, so she eats during the night. But if I just put it all in the bowl, she won't touch it. Now, I don't know if anyone can explain that. Yeah, I mean, it, obviously I take it as a, a sign of um, of an honour, really. That she, she'll... Uh, she only wants to be with me and she's totally comfortable with me. Very strange. And um and Oakley, well, Oakley's developed a lump on his scent gland. It's uh but he's been to see Claire and everything. He's had antibiotics and anti inflammatories. So he's booked in for the thirteenth of May to have it removed. I'm so nervous about it. So nervous. And um but what can you do? And she's gonna take it out, send it to the lab, see if it's uh whether it's a cyst or benign or or hopefully not cancerous. But it needs removing because it's right on his scent gland. So she's just gonna remove it all, see what the results are. So the aftercare is, is I've got to make sure that he doesn't chew his stitches out for for, for at least five days. Cause it'll take about five days for the thumb to dissolve. And um so I've got to keep an eye on him. Take his sand bath out and until he's completely healed. So it's gonna be a, a long trek, so I just thought I'd warn you about that beforehand, so my time will be taken up with him during that week. So he's due he's booked in for the thirteenth of May. And um so we'll see how we get on with that. And she thinks he's got stargazing as well. Because I don't know if I mentioned it, but um, I'm sure I mentioned it to you guys. He's, uh, his head's all over the place and it, it just keeps stirring and things like that. And, and when you go to open the, the, the lid in, on the hamster cage, instead of a normal hamster, it'll just look straight up and can hold the head up proper. His head will be all over the place, which is really sad. Really sad. So, um, yeah, I don't know what's going on there. But she's looking really beautiful. Just look at her coat. I know the camera doesn't do her colour justice, but she does have like a like a bluey in her, like a blue colour in her. Come on then. Come on. <laughs> she's absolutely a delight, but so strange. See, now she's had that half now. So she's so she'll be quite happy. I know it's all in her pouches, but but it's just weird. It's just weird, hamster, aren't you? Come here, come here, Pepple. Come, come. <laughs> My little Bailey. Yeah, thank you, Bailey. Bailey, Bailey. <laughs> so just thought I'd do a quick vlog, just so you know what's um. Uh, and I've still not had the time to put the book estate up yet. I'm still trying to uh. Find a date to get someone to assemble it because I I can't do it. I'm just just needs two people to do it. 
some dust all plus at things like that. So, um, yeah. I've got two new foods coming soon, which I, um, which, I, which will be interesting to do a, refu uh, a, a review on as well. So, um, come here. Come here. Come here. <laughs> come around there. She's very crafty. Yeah, she's very crafty. I know what you want. You want to go and play your favourite game, don't you? Yeah, you want to go and play your favourite game. And stop nibble, nibble. Nibble, nibble, nibble. Nibble, 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 nibble. <laughs> Come here, where are you? <laughs> You're so cute. You're adorable. Yeah, guys, I just thought I'd let you know what's happening and where I'm up to and things like that. And I'll keep you up to date with Oakley's uh, operation when he has it and things. And uh, I'll show you my new kitchen when it's all been done in May. And uh, total, total nightmare. I'm not looking forward to that, actually. I'm not looking forward to May at all. <laughs> so, you're beautiful, aren't you? Are you going to say goodbye, baby? I call her baby for short, Bailey. Do you get it, baby? Bailey? Hello, you are so squirmy. <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> you coming on my hand? You're grown into a nice, beautiful girl, aren't you? Yes, you are. We all thought you was a boy. Yes. Not to worry. These things happen. Yes, these things happen. <laughs> All right, then. Bye, guys.